Hi, I'm Perry Romanowski, creator of the Cosmetic Chemist Corner. And in this video, I'm going to tell you the seven things that every expert cosmetic formulator must know. But first, let me tell you about my experience on becoming a cosmetic chemist. To tell you the truth, I never even thought about the cosmetic industry when I was in college. I had an interest in science and, and got a degree in chemistry, but didn't have an, any idea of what I was going to do when I got out. You'll find this is true of many people with science degrees and people that started in the cosmetic industry. Fortunately, I landed a job at a shampoo company and stumbled into the world of cosmetic formulating, and I really enjoyed it. But what I quickly discovered was that very little of the information I learned in college was helpful for my job as a formulator. And worse yet, the industry was rather secretive, so it was extremely difficult to learn how to formulate. There were a few books and magazines, but I mostly had to rely on my more experienced co-workers or just personal experiences to train me in the ways of professional formulators. I found this incredibly frustrating. So that led me to team up with another formulator and we co-wrote the book Beginning Cosmetic Chemistry. This was a book for formulators who were in my position, just starting out with almost no formulation background at all. But in writing that book, we first had to figure out the key information that every formulator needs to know. That helped ensure that we wrote a practical and helpful information that formulators could use on their job every day. It would help start newcomers on their way to becoming expert formulators. So what are these key things that every cosmetic formulator needs to know? Well, here we go. I've broken them down to just seven. So number one is to know the industry. First, you have to know the industry. When I was starting out, I had no idea which companies were making cosmetics, who the raw material suppliers were, or what brands were being produced, or even what cosmetics were. This knowledge is extremely helpful in learning who your competition is, what the trends are that drives consumer interest, and even gives you ideas about what types of new innovative formulations you'll need to make. Additionally, knowing the industry will help you find a job it can improve your career options and even help you innovate. To be an expert, you have to know the cosmetic industry. Of course, knowing the industry is only one small aspect of being an expert cosmetic formulator. One of the most important aspects is knowing the raw materials. When you're in college, you don't spend a lot of time talking about the chemical and physical properties of any specific raw materials. Mostly you talk about classes of ingredients and their chemical properties. But when you are formulating, you need more detailed information about the raw materials, such as the physical characteristics, the way they interact, the, what they do, and of course, their cost. Traditionally, you only get to learn about these materials by going to trade shows and, and getting samples and, and just working with them. It can take a really long time. The third thing is to know the science. Now, the raw materials are important, but to really be an expert formulator, you need to know the underlying science behind using particular ingredients. You need to know why you use one ingredient over the other and why mm -hmm. some raw materials are included in certain types of cosmetics while others aren't. Additionally, you need to know the effect of things like the pH, viscosity on formulas, and how these can affect the way you produce quality and stable products. Now, the fourth thing is to know the formulas. While raw materials and science are the bedrock knowledge you need to start formulating, you can't formulate like an expert unless you have a good familiarity with all the formula types and cosmetics forms that they can take. To really be able to shine, you need to know how to formulate solutions, emulsions, powders, solids, gels, aerosols, and more. You'll need to have a background in all of these formulas and how they apply to any specific formulation problem you are trying to solve. The fifth thing is to know the critical testing. Now, making cosmetics is important, but well-rounded professional formulators are also know how to test them to ensure that they are safe, stable, and properly functional. Often you will be running tests on your formula to support claims, demonstrate safety, and even invent new functionality. Every cosmetic formulator needs to know how to properly test their creations. And if you're interested in launching your own cosmetic line, well, you'll need to be able to have all the proper testing completed to keep yourself out of legal trouble. 
Number six is to know how to scale up formulas. Making cosmetics in a lab is fine for creating a few samples, but if you want to have a successful product line, you're going to need to scale up production. And a professional cosmetic chemist knows the tips and tricks required for taking a formulation from a lab bench beaker to a production floor. No, uh, uh, making a 500 gram batch is vastly different from making a 5,000 gallon batch. Professional cosmetic chemists must know how to scale up their formulas. And the seventh thing is to know the marketing process. An expert cosmetic chemist has to know about the product development and marketing process. This means you need to know just how companies generate ideas for products and test those ideas with consumers to see whether they are going to have a successful product or not. As a formulator, you are intimately involved with every step along the way of helping the marketing groups know what can and can't be done, and learning from consumers what type of aesthetic characteristics they want from their formulas. Plus, if you want to start your own cosmetic line, you'll need to know what to do to market your product and how you're going to do that. So now that you know what you need to know to become an expert formulator, how are you going to learn it? Well, when I was first formulating, I had the benefit of working with seasoned formulators and also had access to an extensive formulation library. It was really great. But most people I know are not in that situation. That's why we are creating the Practical Cosmetic Formulating course online. It is suitable for anyone who is starting as a formulator and wants to learn how to create safe, stable, and effective cosmetic formulas. In our upcoming cosmetic science program, I've taken those seven key things that every expert formulator must know and expanded on them to help give you all the information you need to create cosmetics like a professional cosmetic formulator. Now we're not quite ready to take students, but the course will be starting shortly. In the next few days, I'll send you all the information you'll need to know to sign up. Thanks so much for watching. I'm Perry Romanowski, and I look forward to working with you.